Monday, December 5th, 2022. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Do we have minutes? Mm, no. no. Thank you, I just hope to have a couple budgets in front of you guys next week. So I'm get a couple of them to you. Okay, how's it, how's it going so far? Who have you met with? Uh, first saw you met with I've Joe met Gannett. with uh, Bennett, Kevin Baxter, had some phone conversations with Barb, Sessler, and obviously you've been working on budgets under the board, so commissioners, finance. IT, microfilm, so I've got most of those done. Uh, I think I'm trying to schedule one with our county engineer for the 16th was the date I threw out when they were here at the last meeting. I have not heard back. I, I'd like to bring Tim back at our next meeting, if it's possible. You can ask him, buddy. Um, I had a couple thoughts on that uh, road. Oh, the Lawrence Wakeman? Yeah. And it wasn't a hundred thousand to truck the stone or to do the grinding. It was 175. Okay, I looked that back up. Okay. Which I thought it was. So, but anyway, that if you did all three of the roads. But what I'd be curious about, and maybe he'll listen to this and he can get the information, but there might be a way that uh, you could grind. It's called uh, like a shaping, like Boca would do it. And they would take their machine and they would replane the road. And instead of doing, you know, like I said, like one inch, mm -hmm. they would plane off maybe an uh, inch and a half, let's say, where it needed on the edge, to whatever they needed for the shape. And then once they get the road in shape, then they would put there maybe an inch and a half of asphalt, a little bit less asphalt, but it would be consistent with the bow of the road. And the reason I would say to do that is it would cut the grinding uh, hauling cost. And you would definitely, like I said, coordinate it with that other dippy road. But I got thinking about it. You can't put all those grindings in that dip. Because think about it, when the the problem with grindings is they're eights, maybe 57s, or small stones, and they'll roll. So you need 304s if you're going to build something up thick. You know, you need dust in it to bind it. And so he couldn't just fill that all up, that big hole with number eights, because every time you drive a truck over, it just falls. How big is? How deep does that go? I did not get up. Well, they I can do it whatever they want. You could fill it from here to here, make it three feet if you want, and make right. it straighten right out if you wanted to. But what I would say is to what you would do is you would mix the number eights or the grindings in with dust. There's a machine like a big rototiller that they use that would mix it all together and compact it as it goes. And that would be a, a way to do it. So you use some of the grindings, not as many, half as many say. You'd use a little bit less asphalt and it would save the money. So I don't know what he thinks about all that. He can listen to the tape and hear me rattle on. But, uh, just the thought. How hard is it for them to coordinate? Like, if you were gonna share this, take it off of one, put it on another. Oh, easy, that... easy. As long as he gets the pipes in now, mm -hmm. he gets the pipe work done. So, whatever. Okay. I guess we just have legislation. That's it. We got a lot of uh, water tap fee, and so it's gonna <clears throat> got my lozenge ready. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of establishing an installment schedule of payments for water tap fees servicing the property located at 9505 Bemis Road, Bellevue, Ohio. Tax ID number 29-00185, decimal 006. Second. Mr. Shockman. Yes. Mr. Old. Yes. Mr. Shenago. Yes. Mr. Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of declaring certain Erie County equipment surplus and ordering same to be sold by internet auction. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. 
Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of authorizing the county engineer to proceed by force account for normal maintenance and repair of county roads, bridges, culverts, and associated roadside drainage. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shanova? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of entering into an agreement amendment with the Erie County General Health District Board of Health. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Ruth Krischer, located at 1704 West Bogart Road, Sandusky, Ohio, tax ID number 32-01330-000 for installment payments for sanitary sewer tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Michael L. Holliday, located at 918 Bardwell Road, Castalia, tax ID number 33-00010-000 for installment payments for water tap services. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Dorothy M. Smith, 6109 Bardwell Road, Castalia, tax ID number 33-00711 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or, liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Katie S. Driscoll, located at 6015 Bardwell Road, Castalia, Ohio, tax ID number 33-01251-000 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Richard L. Stout and Susan M. Stout, located at 5316 Billings Road, Castalia, Ohio, tax ID number 33-0047006 for installment payments for water tap services. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Richard A. Yance and Tracy L. Yance, 6516 Allspall Drive, Castalia, Ohio, tax ID number 33-00945 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Stephen L. Stout and Sandra S. Dez, located at 5320 Billings Road, Castalia, Ohio, tax ID number 33-0047400 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. <clears throat> Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Roderick H. Bratton and Mary H. Bratton, located at 1317 Berlin Road, here in Ohio, tax ID number 39-0841003 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Mark A. Robleski and Kathleen A. Robleski, located at 101710 Berlin Road, Berlin Heights, Ohio, tax ID number 01-0048200 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now were formerly owned by Catherine C. Fultz, 5914 Bellevue Castalia Road, Castalia, Ohio, tax ID number 33-01669000 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of releasing any liens or claims of liens against property now or formerly owned by Corso Realty at 3905 Bardshaw Road, Sandusky, Ohio, tax ID number 33-01947009 for installment payments for water tap services. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of authorizing the county auditor to make supplemental appropriations and budget modifications. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Move for adoption resolution, Board of Commissioners, for the purpose of executing payment of then and now certification. Second. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes. Is that it? That's it. Motion to adjourn. Second. Mr. Old? Yes. Mr. Schaffner? Yes. Mr. Shenago? Yes.